Hello, I'm Markus Neubauer and I want to give you an introduction to the world of electric traction motors. I'm currently employed at Traktion Systeme Austria, who is one of the biggest manufacturers of railway traction motors in the world. Before I was responsible for the innovation management in our company, I did the design for railway traction motors and generators for approximately 10 years. In chapter 1, we are going to have a look at the variety of different railway traction motors and for that reason I will take you on a journey from Vienna to Birmingham. In chapter 2, we will have a look at the physical principles. We will hear about Ampere, Maxwell and Lorentz. In chapter 3, we will use this knowledge and discover how does the traction motor work and so we go from the electrics via the magnetics to the mechanics and we will see how the induction machine works. In chapter 3a I will try to explain how the rotating field is produced in the electric machine. In chapter 4 we will have a look at different motor concepts like the synchronous machine as it is the permanent magnet machine or the electrically excited synchronous machine and also at commutator machines. In chapter 5 we will have a glance at the standard 6349 and in chapter 6 we will see different traction motor cooling concepts for example air and liquid cooling, self and forced ventilated machines and open and decapsulated machines. In chapter 7 we will finally have a look at the advantages and disadvantages of permanent magnet machines compared to the induction machine. So please enjoy the lessons and if you have any questions please don't hesitate to ask.